Hi everybody, it's Christina from Christina's Crafts. I'm going to be doing a Christmas DIY today. I got one of these um, glass candle holders from Dollar Tree and a snow globe, the smaller one. And then I also have some trees and a little gnome and a welcome sign. And what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take this off of here, set that aside, and then I am going to take my black flat primer sp um, spray paint and I am going to spray paint this and this part of the cover. And then after that dries, I am going to take my Blue Galaxy um, Color Shift spray paint and spray paint both of those that color. Okay, I have um, my candlestick sprayed. So first I sprayed it, bleh, sprayed it with the black <clears throat> spray paint and then this Galaxy Blue. Now I am not the best at spray painting, so I did actually have some runs and I have some bare spots here, but I'm just gonna use the best side, which I'm thinking is going to be this one. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is, I also sprayed the bottom of my snow globe thing, and I'm gonna set this aside, and then I am going to put these things inside of my snow globe. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use these little wooden circles that I have and I'm going to kind of build them up so they stick up a little bit um, in the snow globe because if you put it down, it's going to be sitting too far down in there and this insert pushes it up way too far. So I am going to estimate about where I want my stuff and then um, I'm going to use my little circles to build it up. So I'm just going to stick a little hot glue on here and then I'm going to push this down. I'm going to try to stay as close to the middle as possible because of because I have to screw the lid back on. So I'm just going to kind of get these down here and then just kind of start building them up until I have them a good height. Okay, so I have my little wood pieces in there and they're all built up. So now I am going to put my my little figurines in there. So I'm just gonna stick some hot glue on these. Should turn it that way. Now all these, the bottle brushes and the little Santa and the welcome sign, I got all those at Dollar Tree. And the snow globe and the candlestick holder. And then this is going to go on here like this, but I don't like the way that inside looks. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to put some of this buffalo snow in there. So I'm going to get that open and we're going to see how we're going to do this. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this is going to make a huge mess. But we're going to try it. I have some of this like glittery buffalo snow and then this is just buffalo snow but it's a little bit thicker. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to stick some hot glue in here and just kind of dust the buffalo snow on top of my little pieces here trying to cover them up. Oh geez. Just like that. I'm afraid if I dump it in the snow globe and then turn it around, it's just going to get everywhere. So I'm just going to just keep trying this and see what happens. Okay, so I'm not having a lot of luck with the hot glue and the snow. So I think what I'm going to have to do is I'm just going to have to dump it in there and try to screw the lid on. So I'm just going to take it and fill it in. I mean, it was starting to cover, but it was just taking a really long time. So I'm just going to stick the snow in here and then just try to screw the lid on. And hopefully I can get it down tight. This stuff is pretty thin, so back. All right, and then I'm going to try to screw the lid on and we will see what happens. Even if I can't get it down all the way. Oh, that actually doesn't look too bad. 
can maybe almost put a little bit more snow on there. But I think that's going to be good. All right, let me get this mess cleaned up and then we'll finish putting this together. Okay, so now I got a little bit of sloppiness down here. So I am just going to take some of this um, ribbon trim that I got from Dollar Tree and I am going to wrap it around my globe. So just put that on there. And I think I'm just going to do go around twice just to make sure it's all filled in good. Snip that off. Okay, and then I'm going to have to get the E6000 out because um, I don't think hot glue is going to work the best on this. All right, so I have my E6000 out. Just going to stick it. And a couple spots on here. I'm trying to get it so it doesn't gush off. All right. And then I'm going to stick a little hot glue. Just for the little instant hold real quick. Yeah, and hopefully center that on there. It looks pretty centered. All right, I think I am just about done. Okay, so for the final touch, um, I had some of this old fray ribbon that I got from Dollar Tree, and I am just gonna stick a bowl right on the front here. And I think that's going to be it. I don't want to put too much on it. So I just made myself a little bow. And that's it. It is all finished. I think, <laughs> I know I always say this, but it really did turn out really cute. I love this spray paint that I got. Um, I just got it from Joann's. I had a gift card, so I went ahead and used it. But, yep, it's all finished. Um, this is pretty much all Dollar Tree, except for the spray paint. So, if you want to make one, I think it turned out really cute. Um, I just want to say thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you subscribe and hit the bell so you get notified when I upload. And take care. Thanks. Bye.